My name is Nathan Clements Gillespie. I'm director of Freeze Masters, and I'm here today at the Courthall Gallery, and it is a pleasure to sit in front of Manet's masterpiece, A Bar at the Folie Bergère. The Courtauld Gallery is an extraordinary collection of masterpieces from medieval to impressionism, post-impressionism, and modern art. And the breadth and scope of the collection we see here is indicative of the works that are available at Fries Masters. 2022 is an incredibly exciting year for Fries Masters. The 10th anniversary allows us to look back and see everything that's happened and all that has changed over the last decade. What does it mean to look at the art of the past through the eye of the present? The hallmark of Freeze Masters is to remind every one of us that every work of art was contemporary when it was created. It allows us to travel through time and see and recognize that this is all contemporary art from across the broadest spectrum of human ingenuity and creativity. We have a number of exciting presentations at the fair. You'll see extraordinary objects from across histories and cultures, such as a striking Egyptian sculpture of the god Anubis, a collection of ancient Chinese silver objects, sculpture in bronze, stone and wood, as well as monastic paintings from Tibet. Old master pictures are always a highlight of the fair, and this year is no exception. There will be multiple presentations dedicated to the work of pioneering women artists as well as Phenomena, a special presentation focused on the work of female surrealist artists, all of whom were featured in this year's Venice Biennale. There will be several immersive installations, including one recreating the Athenian villa of Greek dealer Alexander Yolas, and another presentation looking at pre-Raphaelite and Victorian painters, such as Dante Gabriel Rossetti, Ford Maddox Brown, and Edward John Pointer. There will be major presentations of seminal artists such as Daniel Beren, Cy Twombly, and Romari Bearden, Jacob Lawrence, Faith Ringgold, Amina Brenda, and Charles White. There will be a solo presentation of Venezuelan painter Carlos Cruz Diaz and his radical experimentation with color. Spotlight is a curated section that is a hallmark of Freeze Masters. This year's Spotlight is curated by Camille Morino and Aware, a curatorial collective based in Paris and they are highlighting the work of pioneering women artists from the 20th century. Highlights of the Spotlight section this year include works by internationally renowned Batik and Adire artists, Nika Davies Okundaye, Mary Corse's Cold Room, Lucia Marcucci, best known for her provocative and visual poetry denouncing the commodification of the female image, Madvi Parekh's art defined by memory and her strong ethical values, and Frau Nisa Zaid, whose 70-year-long career is rooted in figuration and expressionism. Standout is created by Luke Sison, director of the Fitzwilliam Museum, and this year's theme is Global Exchange, looking at conversations between cultures and bringing together art objects from across the ages that are great works of design, of sculptural and conceptual brilliance. We have invited the celebrated New York-based photographer who will show new work that reflects the status of historical images and their tropes, the portfolio photographs can be found both inside the fair and throughout Freeze Masters magazine. The 2022 Freeze Masters Talks program is curated by Nicholas Cullinan, director of the National Portrait Gallery in London. And this year, for the first time, we are delighted to partner with institutions throughout London. The talks will be taking place in real life around Freeze Week, but will all be recorded and be available on freeze.com for everyone to enjoy. From everyone at Freeze, we can't wait to share this year's fairs with you. Please come, enjoy the fair, and help us celebrate this great 10th anniversary.